Hello, it's Angie. Welcome back to our third episode of Teacher Trivia. Today we have three contestants, and starting left to right, we're going to start over here and state your name and what department or part of the school you are representing. Bryce Culver, Assistant Principal. Sarah Palmer, Team Science. Joe Seller, Social Studies. Okay, and let's get started. So, since we started down at the left, we're going to have the person at the very left start. And so, choose a category and a Grade. We'll go Mr. Sellers Wheelhouse, first grade, social studies. How many states are in the United States of America? Okay, I saw. 50. That's correct. Okay. We'll stick with the cat. Oh, sorry. Oh, oh I get you to choose. Go, but we can go there. Then. I'll stick with the category. Let's go second grade, social studies. Okay. Christianity, Islam, Buddhism, and Hinduism are examples of what? Oh. Uh, religion. Oh. Uh, correct. <laughs> All right. 300, third grade, social studies. All right. Just get social studies done. What do you call collective customs, art, behavior, or social activities in a group? Culture. Yep, correct. Man, I gotta be faster here. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Yep. Down the line. Oh, uh, we'll go so uh, social studies, fourth grade. All right. The production, distribution, and consumption of goods and services refer to what? I, you got to do that one. Economics? <laughs> yes. I wasn't going to hit on that one for you. You got to do that one. Good job. She got it wrong. 500? Oh, wait, no. no, no. Oh, well, yeah, let's do it. 500. Finish, Finish it up. Let's do it. All right. So what act Pretty did Britain impose on American colonists requiring taxes on various papers, documents, publications, and playing cards? Stay back. Yup. Woo! You're on fire with this one. Were the, Tow oh, so. Were the Townsend Acts later? Was that later? I think so. Townsend Acts later? Okay. Yeah, sure. What are we thinking? Let's, sorry, I'm, uh, let's go miscellaneous. miscellaneous? Hey, let's go 500. Ooh! Ooh. Sorry. Okay. Which, which layer of the earth is liquid? The mantle. Um, no. Core! Which one? Center core. Nope. <laughs> Outer core. <Yep. laughs> Are you sure it's not the mantle? Oh, no, 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 no. Outer core. Okay. Don't worry about it. Okay. All right. It's fine. Uh, we'll do uh, miscellaneous for 400. Okay. What is the official language of Brazil? Oh, Ooh, I was not looking up for that. I think I it's Palma. It would be she Portuguese. Yep. Yeah. Correct. Whoop. Okay. Who's next? You're up. You're next. up. Oh, uh, yep. let's do science for 300, please. No. Okay. Oh. Which two gases make up most of our Earth's atmosphere? I saw sound. Oxygen and CO2. And no. <laughs> Oxygen and nitrogen. Yeah. yeah. Oh. Okay. Now, um, who's next? Which is you? Oh, uh, miscellaneous 300. Okay. How many Olympic rings are there? <laughs> oh, I saw a tie, but I think she was fast upon I think there are five. Yep, correct. Okay. Next, who's? I think we'll go back uh, down We'll go there. miscellaneous 200. Get this miscellaneous done. You might as well. What document did the founding, founding fathers sign in 1776? <laughs> Declaration. Yep. That's correct. We, we don't need a full answer. I, I mean, mean, what is what is the Declaration of Independence? If you don't know what the Declaration, I think Declaration of what? Issue. Declaration. <laughs> <laughs> Our loyalty. Oh, right. uh, wait. I just picked that one. Yes. So we go back oh. down. All right. Let's do English five hundred, please. English five hundred. Okay. All right, you know. What is it called when a character goes through a transformation journey in a story? Yes. An arc. You know what? Yeah. Yes. <laughs> yes. Okay. Had to have no English teachers here. You, <laughs> you got it. A okay. hero's <laughs> journey. Uh. Who's next? Um, let's do math for 200. Math for 200. Okay. What is one third of 90? Oh, yes. 30. Yep. yep. What is 30? What is the show? Yeah. You want to start saying that now? Why not? Let's do that. What is 30? I just wanted okay. to know what we were declaring earlier. 
Good. All right, um, let's do math 400. Math for 400, you got it. Oh, hey. What is the area of a rectangular, a rectangular room if one wall is 11 feet long and the other wall is 14 feet long? <laughs> yes. Is it 151? Yeah. Close. What is 151? What, what is 151? Nope, the, the answer is close. Oh. So you still got a little bit off. Oh. oh it's okay. Yep. No. Okay. Do you have any? I don't have one. All right, so the answer is 154. Yep, I forgot the other four. All right. Let's head back to that. Okay. Sorry, math Here's department. <laughs> Uh, what? Oh, it's me? Uh, math 500. Math 500, right. okay. A rectangular prism has a side length of 4 centimeters, 3 centimeters, 4 centimeters. Where's the volume? I know some math. Ooh. I think 48. 48, yeah. That is correct. Mm. Good job. Thank I you. could not do that in my head without a piece of paper, so. <laughs> you did a lot better than me. I okay. don't tell you they'd consider me gifted. <laughs> Who is that? I'm you <laughs> something. All right. Uh, is it my turn? I think so, yeah. Okay. Uh, um, let's go back to science. Let's do science for 500, please. Science 500. Well, all the big it. ones out. I know, right? An electrical current is made up of what kind of particles? Yep. Electrons. Yes. Fair there enough. you go. Okay. Back down to uh, you. Let's do math for 100. Okay. Identify the number in the tens place of 267. Six. That is correct. <laughs> Six. <job. laughs> okay, oh, we can go back up there. Oh, yep. my. Yep. Oh, wow, so fast. Okay, um, let's do science 200. You got it. What is the main part of the plant where photosynthesis takes place? Yep. The leaves. That is correct. Oh, I was going for the organelle. I was like... <laughs> I know. It's the leaves. Like, it's not going to be that specific. <laughs> All right. Okay. Now I go back to you. Miscellaneous 100. You got it. Is food a want or a need? Food? A need. Food. Yep. That is correct. <laughs> okay. Economics. <laughs> what is Maslow's that? hierarchy right there. Uh, yeah. I think it goes... I think you did miscellaneous 100. Yes. So that okay. means that we go back down. Uh, let's go to English for 300, please. You got it. All right. What genre of, books, a, book, of a book or movie is based on imaginary, often futuristic, scientific ideas? Oh, it was one of you two. I think it was you. Sci-fi. Yep, that is correct. Good job. Cut on the board. Science fiction, <laughs> sci-fi. Correct. Okay, now we'll go back down to you. Let's do science for 100. You got it. Rain and snow are a form of what? Precipitation. That is correct. Okay, we only have a few on the board. Wow, okay. Let's go back to you. Uh, math 300. Math 300, okay, the last math. If a square is five inches on each side, where's the perimeter of the square? Uh, 20. That is correct. Uh, wow. Okay. Okay, let's go back. Uh, let's do English for 400. English for 400. You got it. What is the name of a collection of classical stories related to religion or cultural traditions? I feel like you know this, maybe. Do you not? No. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, elective. We have elective here, I know that. Is it? Nobody ever takes the elective. <laughs> <laughs> Who teaches the elective? <laughs> is it mythology? Yes, that is correct. Oh, okay. Oh, mythology. Yeah. You didn't okay. buzz in the mythology. I, mean, I no, did, I'm and I just <laughs> took me a while. I was on the extended time. All right, we have three more. Let's go back. You? Uh, are we done with miscellaneous? Yes. Science. Okay. Science. Okay. All right. Let's yes. finish science, please. 400 science and science English 400. Science. 400. You got it. Solar energy, wind energy, hydro energy, tidal energy, geothermal energy, and biomass energy are all examples of what kind of resources? Renewable resources. That is correct. Mm. Okay. We have two more in English. Kind of a, kind of a, 
Two more in English. 100 or 200? Um, let's go 200 English. You got it. Okay, 200 English. What tense, what tense is a sentence that describes something happening right now? I think it was Present. English. That is correct. And now we have a last one, which is English 100, which is what is the title of a person who is telling a story? The narrator. That is correct. I know. Yeah. <laughs> oh, hey. <laughs> So we got our scores in, and we're going to start <clears> from <throat> the bottom tier, which is the least amount of points, and go to the top. So Carver, we have 1,000. That's, that's Paul, right. we have, have 2,100. And Sella, we have 3,100. Oh! Yeah, You're coming back. back. You're coming back. <laughs> so congratulations to Mr. Sella. And thank you for tuning in for our uh, part three uh, tea trivia, and we'll see you next time.